The Several Journeys of Remus, Chapter 2, was developed by Zbarf and published in 2008 by Newgrounds. After a botched escape attempt, Remus and Liam tumble from the sky. This barn looks familiar. Didn't we? Yes, we came here for a barn party a few months ago. This is Rollo the Butcher's place. Ha, huh, what luck. That means home is just over the hill. Maybe we can make Rollo for a midnight pint or two before we head out. Um, did that pig just explode? It's one of those death slugs. Weird, it absorbs some of the pig's characteristics. I have no interest in seeing a pig slug with a mustache, so let's find a way out of here. Nim, if you trap it, I'll kill it. Okay, how do we... Oh, I'm in the barrel. Okay. We're trapping it. What does this do? Where are you going? Hmm, I need to bait the trap. I thought this was the bait. Uh, that's a goop. Ew. Okay, stab it. Stab it. Stab it. What am I doing with this? Oh. Oh. Now stab it. Do it. Ha. I thought that'd be a lot harder. See, Liam, even the scary slugs are no match for Remus the Exterminator. Sir, you're the one that didn't want to <laughs> you're the one that didn't want to do this in the last game. You said you just wanted to go home. Uh, it just turned itself inside out. That might be our cue to leave. That's the egg sac thing from the last game that just spit out a bunch of them. I've killed just about every bug and slug around, and I've never seen one do that. I don't think we can run from this one, Remus. I say we get back home and gather my tools. I bet I can find something to kill these slugs. Judging from the size of that smoke plume coming from town, I say that won't be an option. Trouble is brewing, Liam. Remus? Sugar bee, honey. This stuff is so sweet it induces temporary diabetic coma. I better watch out. <laughs> Ooh. Remus, wake up. We're in trouble. We gotta wake up Remus. Oh, what? Where, where am I? What happened? Uh, I think we're on something here. Gotta be honest. Oh. Hmm. Darts and a vial of sugar bee honey. Ooh, squished. Okay, okay. Ouch, he's gonna feel that when he wakes up. Uh, looks like he wasn't alone. We better run for it. First death slugs. Now the return of the Gygax? What's going on here? There's only one who will know the answer. We need to find the all-knowing parasite. Whoa, no one's ever been to the parasite and survived. It lives on the tail of the devouring worm. Well, if we can get our hands on some of that sugar bee honey, we can knock out the worm long enough to talk to the parasite. Ha, huh, good idea. I knew there was a reason we hung out. I know sugar bees live in the heart of the flesh-eating forest, so we'll have to venture in. Flesh-eating forest? Maybe we should come up with a plan B. Besides, the trees are too thick. How do we even get in there? Didn't those other guys have some sugar bee honey? Can't we just borrow some of theirs? How big is this thing we're trying to put to sleep? Hmm, there must be a way in. Let's have a look around. Hello, how are you doing? I are you looking for a way to get in here? I might be able to help you. I'll ask in return as one small favor. I got myself a real hankering for a squishy yallopede that lives in the dead plant, but he's a bugger to catch. If y'all can help me catch him, I might be inclined to show you the way in, what'd you say? Seeing as we have no other options, it's a deal. 
So we need this thing out of here. Maybe we can lure it out. I know Yallerpeeds love the taste of peppermint leaves. Whoa. Crawling in through that swamp. What's a peppermint? Are these peppermint leaves? That one's a pepper leaf. It's a pepper leaf, not a peppermint leaf. Looks like the maraca bush is in full bloom and the nuts are almost ready for harvest. Ooh, mint leaves. Doesn't seem to be taking the bait. Uh, what about that with the pepper on it? Pepper and mint. Oh, I got it. Oh no, wiggled out of my hand. Uh, if we get the root out of the ground, we might be able to use it to blast out the slug. How do you suppose we go about that? No point in trying that again. Squishy yellowpeeds are very proud. They don't get fooled by the same trick twice. What are you? If we put this and that. <laughs> Whatever that means. Do it. Stick it in there. Oh. 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 Oh, we can. Sure. Yep. Hmm. Thank you kindly. Oh, deal's a deal. So follow me. Thanks, buddy. See you on the flip side. Wait, I didn't tell you about the tree tentacles. Alright, now how do we find these sugar bees? Well, this isn't good. Looks like a tree tentacle to me. Uh oh. Oh, that was a success, eh, Liam? Liam? Where'd you go? Ah, oh, great. Okay, Liam, hold tight. I'll get you down. I just need to find a way to shock the tentacles. Now, how do we do that? The bubble back slug is really jonesing for some of that plant water. There he is, isn't he? Mm-hmm. Whatever that means. It's one of those na nasty bug zapper plants. Strawberry daiquiri flowers. Hmm. I hear they taste like old boots, though. Ew. Oh, there's an arrow up here. Walk back and forth. All right. Uh, you want this? Can't take you anywhere. Uh, you want some of this? <laughs> yep. I feel the same way. Who are we stabbing you? We stabbing you. We stabbing you. We stabbing you. Who are we stabbing? We're stabbing somebody. We stabbing you. The black slug is full of liquid. Hmm, what should I squirt? <sighs> Well, that works. Okay. Now what are you doing over here? Where's my stabby stab? Oh. Oh, there we go. Don't know what we do with you, but let's go free this guy again. Okay, no. He gets caught again. If I can find a way to keep the zapper open, I can conduct a serious shock. Uh, use a bone or a stick. Hmm. I think these forest creatures would learn to avoid the tree tentacles by now. Oh. Uh, okay. Bone. I can use you, right? Yep, there we go. Thanks, Remus. Quick, follow that bee. Now's our chance. Hey, Chief, what's up? Okay, listen. We're on a mission to find this devouring worm thing so we can talk to that parasite. We need a dabby or honey to knock him out so we don't, you know, get devoured. 
Even if I cared about what you were saying right now, we don't give out honey to non-bees. Well, that's a little speciesist, isn't it? Absolutely. Now buzz off before you feel some real bee power. Hey Steve, how's it going? Hey Ron, what's going alright? Some dirty human is wandering around though, begging for honey. Pfft, humans, can't they just get real jobs like the rest of us? Listen, I just came over to give you this work order. There's a new guy starting today. He'll need these directions to Honeycomb 8, so give them to him when he arrives. Okay, let's get you ready. For what? Your first day of work at Honeycomb 8. Okay, I'll find something to be your wings and antenna. You paint yourself up to look like a bee. We'll meet back here. Let's go. Click to toggle characters. Okay. Uh, well, let's... Uh, Let's, let's go. What are we doing? It's all this. There's more. What, what is all this? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What are you? Should work for the antenna? Oh, okay, 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 okay. What are you? Can I use some of this? Yeah, can I use some of that? I share some of this. Do you want some of this? I guess it doesn't pay to stop and smell the roses. Is this a donut? Oh. Well, that takes care of the wings. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I wish they clear these blackberries. The juice could stain my clothes. You're not wearing much, guy. You're not. You're not wearing much. Uh. Oh, he's already dressed. Then you're watching. You're watching him get dressed. He, he's not gonna fool you. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Can we turn yellow? That cheese could be useful, but those nacho cheese are too brittle to climb. What do these do? you do oh you, you peck <laughs> okay I'm yellow here I am I'm yellow uh, all right what else we got got something black oh you crap no I'm black um but the, the point in shielding myself behind there I'm already covered in juice wait Oh, do I just stand there for... Okay, alright, alright, yellow me again. Can I st Okay, yep. Nope, nope, nope. I wonder if I can have Remus do it. Let me just... Let me, let me, just, let me just... Let me just have Remus do it. Better stay clear of these blackberries. Oh, oh, I know, know this. I know this. All right, I'm in. Look, you see me? I'm in. I'm all the way in. I am it. All right, show time. Hey, you made it. Welcome to the team. Here's your work order. You'll be joining Honeycomb Eight Storage Facility. The directions are all in here. It's guarded by a blue cave ogre named Horus. Just show him your work order, and he'll let you pass. Make sure you enforce a no smoking policy. If you let him, Horace will spend all day smoking and completely ignore his duties. Alright, now get to work. Honey. Well, this looks like the place. Alright, I'll go down and get the honey. It shouldn't take me long. Well, so much for my disguise. Alright. Bridge looks sturdy enough to cross. Looks like the skeletal remains of the last animal that tried to steal honey. Those are glass mushroom roots. Can I just not walk? If, yeah, if it's sturdy enough, just go on. Oh, maybe I'm not going over there. He looks pretty wound up. Maybe I can find something to relax him. Wait, wait. Remus is up. Wait, Remus is up there. What am I doing? That's a weird vine completely hollow inside. But this thing. As much as I can pull it up. What is it? What'd I do? 
Nothing. Uh, what about one of these? Okay. What is this? Pipe leaf. I used to smoke this stuff back in Exterminator College. Right, what do I, do I, oh, okay. Oh, there's one back here. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. What? So I need to, I need to undo the, I need to undo the root. Oh, yep. <laughs> hey, Remus, I need a container of some kind to store this honey. Uh, what about a different one of these? What about one of those? If I could push this thing down, I'd be able to cut this vine loose. Uh, what about you? Best to live it alone if I pull any more. It'll fall on my head. That'll, that'll do it. I need a way to get this down to Liam. Chuck it in the hole. Got it. Now let's find ourselves a hungry worm. Well, from the looks of those bloodstains, it must be the lair of the devouring worm. Uh-oh. Our old friend is back, and he looks like he made some new allies. Okay, Liam. You go talk to the parasite while I try to distract him. Should I try to cover the cave entrance so Liam is safe or just hide? Better hurry and make up my mind. Well, I'd cover it. Cover it. Cover it. Cover it. Cover it. This should do the trick. Oh, cool. Now... Oh. Okay. Now what am I doing? <laughs> am I... I'm hiding in the frog. Ha, huh, eat that, guy Gax. Okay, Liam. Now it's all you. I'm just gonna chill here in this frog. I'm guessing Remus had something to do with this. Oops. Oops. Oh. I'll burn my hand if I touch that bug. It's a good thing that cactus has a built in fire extinguisher. He does. What's this way? What do we, what do we, what do we got? It's one of those flame retardant cactuses. It's a scavenger nest. I better watch my belongings. They're kleptomaniacs. Uh, let's see even deeper. Ooh, it's the worm. Hmm. If I can hide the honey inside something, maybe I can trick the worm into eating it. Oh no. Oh no. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. The thieving bugger. Hmm, I wonder if I can find a way to startle him. Maybe he'll drop it. Park, I got cactus goo all over my hand. Thought that was my hand. But you, can you burn this off? Oh. Oh, set him on fire. It got <laughs> got me dead in this back. Needs to sleep. Okay. Uh, Mr. Parasite, sir, um, we really need your advice. Oh my goodness, he's looking into my soul. To be continued. Ranking hero, hero. We're both heroes. Look at that. If you want to play this for yourself, there's a link in the description to Flashpoint. At the time of playing, only about the first third of the game worked, and I had to play the rest from Armor Games. I'll be doing Chapter 3 soon. <laughs>